Hey everybody, what's up? Barad here, and welcome to Narcosis. Kind of a weird main menu looking we got going here. I literally just started up the game and it just said press X to start and this is where we're at. I was like, wait, am I in the game or what's going on? I'm assuming this is the main menu. Um, yeah, I went to Google and I was kind of like, you know, I wanted to see other games that people have compared to Amnesia and this was on the list and it was pretty cheap so I thought I'd check it out. So let's try and see what it's about. Oh, music's kind of loud. I tried to turn it down, so hopefully it won't be bad. I'll adjust the sound, hopefully, um, after this episode. But yeah, I was I was in a mood. It seems like <laughs> it seems like every five months now I play an Amnesia game, and we play the Dark Descent on the channel already. Oceanova was once oh. in a lifetime. They're breaking new ground, making something meaningful. Mm, this guy's got Mining voice. methane hydrate frozen beneath the seabed. There's alternatives, but none so plentiful. It's clean and safe. I couldn't say no. Sorry about your weekend, but someone had to draw the short straw. Whoa. We've got a lot of updates to get through, but new suit, hell? same rules. Give me a sec. Okay, instruments. O2. Looks good. Flares. And thrust. Those look good as well. Here, you know the drill. You're stressed, panicking, breathing hard. Okay. Sensors tripped. What as you? you know, your O2 burns down a lot faster under stress. Okay, that makes sense. Anyway, let's move. I mean, I've been moving this whole time. I'm waiting on you, dude. Ocean Nova? Let's what see. Scrubbers, check. Temp, check. Lights, check. Camera, check. What is happening? Um. Okay, that was a pretty cool transition. I was confused for a second there. somebody As I was saying earlier, um, it seems like every couple months I have played Amnesia game, and we played Rebirth and Dark Descent, but I have not played March for Pigs or March of Pigs or something. Wait, no, that's a nice nail song. Oh, oh God. Um, but yeah, I think I might play another night or uh, another Amnesia game here soon. But I like these like type of horror games. Oh God, what's going on? Do I just drop down? So, I don't know what else to do. Something's still not. What the hell? Hold on a sec. Um, that I was weird. Thrusters one more time. I don't know how to use the thrusters. Whenever you're ready. Hold L stick and R2. Ah, okay. Oh, you can do reverse? That's badass. Okay, so then, uh... Can I do it to the side, too? Okay, target practice. Fire a couple of flares. Okay. Oh. Do I, wait, do I have to open them up from this thing? Yeah, I don't have any. Oh. Extra retrieve. Oh, okay. Boy. Okay. How do I shoot them? L1. Hold L1 to load one. Oh, to launch it. Okay, so what is that gonna do? Hold L1 to load player and press L1 to launch. Oh, 
Boosh. Oh wait, do I have to land him in this? Is that what the goal is? I didn't even see those there. Okay. There you go, bud. All right. I thought I was just testing them out. I was like, what the hell? Oh, there's another one. And uh, maybe I should pay attention to what he was telling me. Access, check. Thruster, check. Launcher, and check. Let's get out of here. Grab a little sunshine while we can. Um, that doesn't look like sunshine to me. Oh God. What the hell? So we're here again. Oh, it wants me to use the thrusters. That's what it is. Uh, that makes sense. What are these noises? I'm not exactly sure where I'm supposed to go, though. Like, do I need to be up there? What is this music? Oh, it's so creepy. I'm gonna fuck y'all up. Stay away from me. Alright, well, nothing seems to be messing with me. I'm scared, like, something's just gonna come and fucking grab me out of nowhere. I play Subnautica, I know what goes down in the deep dark. That's what I'm scared to look at. I think something is up there watching me. Wait, what the hell is that? Oh, uh, hey, what's up? Welcome back, my friend. What's going on, my friend? Hey. You alright? Yeah, I'm fine. What's up? Let's get back to the hat. Yeah, let's go. That's it. Ah. Lock up on the oxygen. Very nice. I will take it. Robots all riled up. Don't want to miss that. I'll circle back with JJ tomorrow. Get this all wrapped up. God, that would be so weird. I would not be able to handle this as a job. Like, there's no way. I'm sitting here walking around in fucking Fallout armor <laughs> underneath the water. Oh, it's terrifying. Thankfully, people make video games, so I can experience it that 10 way. 10 so. Oh. February 2nd. We were 50 miles from the epicenter. But an 8 on the Richter scale makes that kind of distance irrelevant. It sounds like there's something else, right? There's something else. Something's off. You hear that shit? Sure. That's the bridge. The shockwaves uh, hit six minutes later, striking the south face of the hab first and uh, hardest. 27 minutes in, with that kind of concussive force, even the sealed modules were compromised. Uh, After that came the ocean. By 1033, only safe havens in a sub or one of the suits. That's right, because they said an earthquake hit, so then the shockwave didn't hit till six minutes later. Fuck. I was wondering, because I'm like, what is, like, that sound? It almost sounded like something huge was walking next to us. That's fucking creepy. But it was, like, the aftershock, because I didn't even think about that, like, how, how an earthquake would sound underwater. That would be intense. Only safe haven. Okay. So, apparently, we're, like working on stuff underneath the water. Like, we're miners or something, maybe. Which way am I going? This way? Oh, what the hell is that? Can I help him? What? What? Wait, I'm confused. 
What is happening? What the fuck is happening? Whoa! Are you okay, dude? Uh... Um... Did I just have, like, a panic attack? What the hell was that? Oh god. super scary though, because I was just like, I don't know, I guess maybe I expected it or something, but that's pretty good looking. Twenty-five percent left. Oh let's go over here. There's bound to be some why did the lights just shut off? I can't believe you're doing this to me name. Come on now. Return to compass. Do we have the knife because like we're actually gonna have to fight stuff? Or is it just like help cut stuff out of the way? Oh, that sounds like boiling water. That does not sound good. Now I'm wondering... One hit is dead. <laughs> oh, you know what? <clears throat> I bet you I know what you do. I don't know if that makes sense better or worse.
of people distracted. All right, there we go. We got out of it. I don't know. I don't know what that was about. That was kind of creepy, though. Okay, dude, these underwater sounds are pretty unbearable. Shit, where are we about to slide into? That is not a good sign. 50% of oxygen. Does it do that every time it saves? Oh, it's because it's a new chapter. Okay, step by step. Hmm, so we figured out in the beginning we were just trying to make our way back to base with our friend and then the earthquake hit and just fucking launched us. Unfortunately, he did not survive. thrusters here. Ooh, more oxygen. Yes, please. That's kind of creepy though. Like, you take the oxygen off of your back and then you plug it in there and like, yep, I'm good to go. Like, what happens if you run it? Nice. Got the flares. Let's move on. I assume this is the right way. I usually just try to follow the light. When it's all bearing down on so many levels, it's got to be managed. You can't shake the pressure. Just make your peace with it. Don't let it take the wheel. Yeah, I mean, you kind of really don't have a choice in this situation, though. Like, I mean, you have to, like, try and keep your cool as much as you can, but we also don't even know what all is down here. I mean, granted, it seems like we're in the real world. Um, but we still don't even know what lies in the deep dark. Down in the belly of the ocean. Is that another gap right there? It is. Oh god. I definitely thought for sure I messed that up. I was like, we're about to fucking fall and die. That's not good. <laughs> that was an interesting technique. I, I don't know if I was supposed to jump or if I actually could just fall on it and just let it ride the fall. I don't know. I definitely have me concerned. I'm like, oh, please don't fall. Okay, that's a huge ass pipe. Just gonna keep following us. <gasps> Damn it, dude. That scared the fuck out of me. I didn't know what it was. <laughs> I just saw a big thing just appear before my face. Oh, that was not cool. Oh, no, you don't. Stop that. that up? Or are we okay? I think we're okay. Oh my god, dude, that was fucking creepy. Who knows how far we would have fallen down. Okay, we still got on oxygen. Not worried about flares. Use the thrusters. So I'm like, uh oh, hold on. 50% of oxygen remaining. What should I do? Just, you know, refill. <laughs> what is that? It went the right. I'm gonna go left. I don't trust it. There's protocol for everything. Has to be. Second guessing puts lives at risk. So it's best to stick to procedure. 
step by step. So with an all-hands call, you head straight for Compass 1. Try and reach surface from comms. Yeah, but we still have to figure out how to get back there. They're like, we don't even know. How do you say? You said we were pretty far away, like 50 miles or something? This is really pretty. Like I said, I hope the music's not too loud. I even turned some of the stuff down because I did a test recording before I started this episode and shit was loud as hell. There's a file. Whoa. Okay. Gisra. I found her at the perimeter of Compass 1, too close for comfort. Like me, she was lucky out on Eva when the tremor started. Probably headed back in search of the others, or at least a little calm in the storm. Her visor was shattered, but her face, bathed in blue light, was quiet, if not quite peace. Another sleeper in the veil, a plain, uh, a plain painful reminder of how little separates us from the elements. Something tells me this is worse than I thought. What did it say? Something corruption? Weird. Well, I'm sorry, Ezra. That sucks. You were really close, apparently. Apparently we're closer to Compass 1 than we thought. What the fuck was that? <gasps> Get it off of me! Ah, it's a fucking squid or something. Oh my god. Oh, dude, I swear, why is it not working? Ah, oh, that scared the shit out of me. I didn't know what the hell was going on. Large lad. Oh my god. So tell me I can refill my air. I didn't mean to hit X. Or square? Hit attack. I didn't mean to do that. Oh man, that fucking terrified me, dude. I was just like, I didn't even know if we were gonna see anything or not. I was like, wait, what's happening? So I guess this way then? Yeah, compass one! Hello? Okay. Yeah, this load screen's though. It's a little bit long. That's right, though. I can edit those out. Um, confirm. Hi, guys. I'm here. Hello. From the Please outside, somebody else is alive. the structure seemed intact. Yeah, so I figured fine. whoever's inside might... Well, maybe it's okay. Whoa. Proceed to inner seal. We ran all kinds of drills. You believe you know what to expect. But once I got inside, Whoa. where it's familiar and you should feel safe. Even though I had to, those first few steps weren't easy. Okay, I was like, is somebody stuck in there? So wait, who who is getting a hold of us then if there's nobody alive here okay so we have two doors we can go through let's go on through this one that one doesn't look like that opens oh I don't like these tight corridors Right, there's fishies down here too. This place must be busted open then. That's some oxygen right there. What? <gasps> oh my god, dude. What the fuck? I was like, why did the fucking music just stop? Oh, I hate it. Whoa. I go past it. Okay. God dang, you scared the shit out of me with that. Hey guys, wet floor? Make sure to watch your foot. Your footing, I guess, is the word I was looking for there. I know English. I'm really good with English. Unlock, please. Oh. 
this looks a little overrun, doesn't it? Um, hello? Is there anybody here? Am I the only one? Oh. Crab just straight up blocking the path. Yeah, I hear a little fishy. What's this? Oh, we're good on flares. We do need oxygen now. I know there was some back that way. I think we might be we good to keep going now. Let's see. Yeah, there's some right there. Perfect. I will take that, thank you very much. Can I access this computer? Nope, it is completely fucked. That's another thing too, you can like literally only look up and down like in the suit. You can't like actually like bend over or anything like that to see it. What the hell? Hello? Gosh, just, oh no. That sucks. Was that? That was so fucking loud. Did the facility just fall over? Oh, did like the ceiling collapse? was fucking dead. Assholes. <laughs> that caught me off guard. Oh. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? What is happening? What is happening? Oh, I don't like it. Oh, hey. destroyed here. Was this just an outfit? Right? Okay. Why? Oh god. Oh god. What is happening? sense. What is this? I had an ID. I was wondering, there was a few of those that we had seen. Dr. Pallavi was the first to reach the evac pod and caught in the blast when it ruptured. In a sealed environment, flames burn hotter, pro uh, propagating it at an accelerated rate. Chemicals confined spaces, oxygen-rich air. As a chemist, she understood the risk better than most of us. But that didn't keep her from grousing... Grousing? I don't know what that is. Rising about how all the restrictions stimulated her research. We each had our own challenges, personal and professional, in the lab. But we were all in the same boat. Only now, it's a Viking funeral. Fuck, man. Okay, so that's the things. We're trying to find all of these. Okay. I feel like I, I, I wasn't able to grab a few before. That makes me sad. I didn't realize that. Because the one lady was hanging there, and I tried to grab it, and it didn't work either. Alright, um, unable to establish contact, 
the surface. Oh, tell me there's some oxygen somewhere. Oh. Reaching the surface was off the table, physically or otherwise. Okay. So it's simple. Hitch a sub to Compass 2 and hope others did the same. Okay, so we can just go to another facility then. That's good. Oh no, I only have 10% of oxygen. That is not a good sign. Oh wait, there's more right here. Okay. Slightly worried for a second there. I was just like, uh oh, this could be a problem. Okay, we're good. Oh, it's like a new model. Better maybe it's just like a clean version of it. Alright, I do believe we need to go this way. Alright, so we're, our goal is to get a sub. And we're gonna go to Compass 2. Every time this opens, these doors. Normally, I the habs are lit up top to bottom, all the time. A lot of the gear was waterproof. Some of the lights and monitors were still running. So it wasn't dark, but it's fading. Like the whole thing's on life support. What the fuck was that? God damn it. I only saw the corner of it. it scared the fuck out of me on top of the noise. Good lord. Fucking hell, game. Not cool. I didn't mean to do that. I just thought that the lights were going out, so... Oh, can we actually go? Oh, shit. Okay. When things go wrong, don't go with them. Hello? I hear a phone ringing. Can I go on this one? I cannot go on this one. Hello? It's gonna be different when we turn around. Oh, God! What the hell? Wait, am I still in. Okay, I'm still in the room. I never left the room. Oh, that's fucking confusing. I was wondering, because I'm like, dude, I thought all these doors were unlocked. straight up destroyed. I wasn't sure if we'd like find any more information on it, but ah what the fuck <laughs> keep them away from me. I'm scared. Well all these places look pretty similar. Work on me. Brandy Orvis. Some oxygen, very nice. We'll need that since the game literally scaring the breath out of my character. What? What? What happened? Oh, I don't like this. Ah! Okay, that wasn't so bad. Ah, fucking assholes, man. Okay, so that one doesn't open. That just leaves this one. Hello? Is anybody here? It's relentless. I mean, the isolation is... Oh, God. ...unnatural. Little problems start to spiral. Any baggage you don't check at the surface... ...comes unpacked pretty quick. Some find ways to cope. Others struggle. I mean, I can't imagine that would be an easy way to cope, especially with the isolation, because it's just like, you know, it's okay for humans to be alone a little bit, but to be that much alone, like, there's a lot... What does this say? Iron what? Iron lion. Hmm, okay. Ah. 
there's a lot that goes into it, like being alone and stuff like that. In a place like this, like that's definitely gonna take a toll on your brain after a while. I mean, granted, you have other people in the facility, but it seems like it takes quite some time to get from one facility to another. Uh oh, I saw something fly by. Not one of those guys. Okay. That's not sure if we can see outside. Left or right? This was it. This was hella dark. I don't know if we should go that way or this way. Let's check this side and see what happens. Is that a dead one? I guess so. Yeah, there we go. Wait, no. I was trying to, yeah, I was just trying to get the information. Um, Uzor Stella? Stella Uzor? Um, must have been the right outside of Compass 1 on Shockwave hit. Cut off and forced him to make his way back using the service tunnels. It's hard to believe that something punctured his suit. The local wildlife tends to be docile, skittish. But all this heat and light commotion in this whole place stirred up. And to survive these conditions, it helps to be as gracious of a guest as when you're warm, or as you are a warm of a host. Which is to say, not at all. Sorry, I was struggling reading that one. So I wonder if, like, you get something like... Oh, fuck. Are you kidding me? I thought that thing was dead. Damn it. Watching life go by inside the bubble is cruel. The ones that care get a head start learning to live without you. So the grief comes first, whether or not you're really gone. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, I was like, that was a big fall. I didn't know. I thought we were dropping outside. I wasn't sure. What's this? Oh. Nice. I was just like, what's going on? I'm literally just trying to walk. I'm under fucking attack by this asshole. But I think this is a good spot to stop, friends. I think we should. Uh, I think this is a pretty decent spot of calmness, minus that asshole attacking us there for a second. But I'm curious to see if we actually are going to run anybody else that's like alive, because so far all we've done is just found everybody that got owned, and that fucking sucks. Because it's like he said, like going through all this isolation and stuff and being down here, it's like only going to make things worse for him. So. I guess we'll see if we survive and make it through the rest of this. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like, leave a comment, let me know what you think about the video. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do. Be happy to have you here. If you want to check out any of my other um, playlists, you can check the links in the description or if you go to the channel itself, there's playing on the page right there. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have an amazing day. I'll see you in the next episode.